Welcome back to the latest edition of Larry King Live. Today I am thrilled to introduce a brand new guest to the show. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, children of all ages, please give a warm welcome to Mr. David Letterman. Thank you very much, Larry. You are far too kind. Let me just start off by saying how thrilled I'm to be on the show today, but we will get to the reason why in just a minute. I am not really sure what you mean by that, but let's get started with the interview, shall we? Before we start, I would like to tell you the real reason I'm here on the show today. I already know the real reason, you are here to be my guest while revealing the next word of the week. You are right about the word of the week part, but... The rest is not entirely true. I'm not here to be your guest. Sure you are. Not exactly. You see? Mr. Bailey has sent me to give you a very important message. You must mean the new word of the week, right? Not exactly. I have good news and bad news for you, Larry. Which would you like to hear first? Good news, please. The show will go on. What is the bad news? The show will go on without you. I'm here to ask you if you would agree to relinquish control of the show. Relinquish? What does it mean? It sounds serious. It also sounds like it could be the word of the week. You know, relinquish. I was trying to ask you politely to give up, quit, abandon, drop, retire, surrender, or hand over your position as host to me, David Letterman. Are you out of your mind? Kids love me. Oh, I get it. You kidding right? That is just the word of the week. You don't really mean that. I am Larry King. I am tired of people trying to bamboozle me with all kinds of shenanigans. Kids do love you. However, there is a new sheriff in town, and his name is David Letterman. I am not a quitter. I will never ever quit. I was born to host this show. Larry, this town is not big enough for the two of us. I'm going to take this show in a new direction. It is time for a change. Give me one good reason that I should relinquish my job as host of this program. Not only will I give you one reason, I will give you an entire top 10 list of reasons. Oh, really? I would like to hear that. Sort of. 10. I'm a phenomenal host. 9. I have a ravenous appetite for new words. 8. I'm a diligent talk show host. 7. I never get discombobulated by a guest. 6. I never ever get bamboozled by Will Ferrell. 5. I have a multitude of talents. 4. You can sometimes be a cantankerous old man. 3. I can dance. Two. I can sing. And number one, Mr. Bailey has hired me to take your job. Wait, did you just say that Mr. Bailey has hired you? More importantly, did you just say that you can sing? Prove it. I love a good singer. Told you I had a multitude of talents. Check it out. So I put my hands up there playing my song. The butterflies fly away not in my head like yeah mom in my hips like yeah I got my hands up. They're playing my song I know I'm gonna be okay. Yeah it's a party in the word nerd way. Yeah it's a party in the word nerd way. Wow. I guess I have to admit that was very impressive. I guess it would be nice to retire to Florida and just sit on the beach all day and play bingo all night. That actually sounds pretty fun. I will relinquish my job for you. You would be a stupendous host. I promise to carry on your tradition and make you proud. Plus, you are always welcome to be an honorary guest anytime you wish. Deal. So to recap the show, the word of the week, relinquish was given to Mr. Bailey by Dominic. This word means to give something up, let go of something, or surrender. Just like I. Larry King I'm going to relinquish my duty as host of the word of the week. 
for the final time. This is Larry King signing off for now. See you next week for the next edition of the Word of the Week.